One of the questions that we get the most often at Tribe is, should I use a CRM? Which CRM should I use? And the first thing I want to share, uh, Tribe, is that it is absolutely mission critical for you to be using a CRM. And no, Excel is not enough. Uh, Excel is one of the most widely used CRMs there is, but I'm, I'm telling you right now, it is not enough. You need a tool that will automate your best intentions. What does that mean? It means that you know that McDonald's is the highest grossing restaurant in the world, not because it has good food, but because people know that they can rely on what they're gonna get when they show up at the store. That's what your business needs to be like. And that system, that operating system is your CRM. It, it should be managing your contacts, managing your workflows and automating all of those touch points that you know that you need to create an exceptional client experience. If well implemented, your CRM should be choreographing all of the efforts of your team members. It should be ensuring that none of your clients or referral partners ever feel like they're being left out of the process of being well communicated with and well updated. When implemented properly, a CRM will feel like and in fact have the economic value of adding one or sometimes even two or three team members depending on which pillar of business you have your CRM pointed to. So when I say pillar of business you have your CRM pointing to, I'm referring to leadership, lead generation, lead conversion, transaction management, and that client for life database management. There are pieces of the CRM journey that can touch all five of the pillars. Don't try to tackle them all at once. Intuitively, your lead management and your post-closing follow-up, very easy to handle uh, in, in a CRM and out of the box, everyone will be able to do that. But as you get deeper and deeper down the CRM rabbit hole and find out how powerful they can be for you, um, you'll find that even leadership, lead conversion and transaction management can be very well served by the workflows and the strategies that a well-executed CRM can, can bring to your business. Now, what you're not gonna hear on this weekly wisdom is a recommendation for a CRM. Um, what I am gonna share is the best CRM is the one you use. It's one of the most cliche statements in the mortgage industry, but it is true. Uh, we will be over time introducing some best practice and we're gonna be sharing some recommendations of some very powerful mortgage CRMs that are out there. Uh, but don't wait for that to start acting and doing some diligence, finding out what might work uh, for you and your business and know that the juice is worth the squeeze. If you don't have a CRM, you are costing yourself hundreds of thousands of dollars. Go out and get one.